Manchester United learn Barcelona's Frankie de Jong stance as transfer meeting takes place. Latest Manchester United transfer news and gossip includes an update on Ferdi Cadioglu and Frankie de Jong. Manchester United have reportedly had a meeting with Ferdi Cadioglu's agent to inquiry about a potential deal. Interest in the left back has ramped up since Euro 2024, where he's shown for Turkey. The 24-year-old caught the eye of scouts from his displays in Germany. Cadioglu helped his nation reach the quarter-final of the tournament, with two wins in the group stage and a famous victory over Ralf Rangnick's Austria. Their hopes of setting up a semi-final with England were dashed after a narrow defeat to the Netherlands. Nonetheless, Fenerbahce continued to face a serious challenge in keeping him beyond the summer window. Last month, Newcastle, Arsenal, Brighton and Borussia Dortmund had all been credited with interest in the left-back. Meanwhile, reports in Turkey claimed United were seriously interested in Kadioglu but were yet to contact the Turkish team over a possible deal. It appears they have now stepped up their interest by meeting up with Kadioglu's representative. Journalist Yagiz Sabunkoglu states United made an inquiry about the contract terms the player would demand in case an agreement is reached with Fenerbahce. Elsewhere, Barcelona have made their Frankie de Jong stance clear amid interest from United. Football Espana's Matteo Moreto claims Barca are open to selling the midfielder, but he will come to a cost. The Spanish giants are said to want around 51 million pounds, 60 million euros, plus add-ons for the player. However, de Jong has reiterated his happiness to remain in the Catalan capital. He said, Staying at Barca? Yes. I'm very happy in Barcelona with my family, for sure, he said. Hansi Flick wants me to be key? I talked to him, it was good. After the European Championship, we will see. The 27-year-old is once again being linked with a move to Old Trafford this summer, two years after United agreed a fee with Barcelona to sign him only for the deal to fall through. De Jong knows United boss Eric Ten Hag well from their time at Ajax together, where the Eredivisie side reached the Champions League semi-finals in 2019. In the heart of Barcelona, beneath the grandeur of Camp Nou, a crucial meeting was unfolding. Inside a sleek, modern conference room adorned with the club's rich history, representatives from Manchester United and Barcelona gathered to discuss a potential transfer that could shake the football world. As the clock struck 11 a.m., Manchester United's delegation, led by their director of football Tom Edwards, entered the room. His suit was immaculate, his expression focused. Beside him were negotiations specialist Laura Green and financial advisor Mark Carter. They took their seats opposite Barcelona's sporting director Ramon Costa and financial manager Elena Morales, both of whom had been briefed on the stakes of the day. Thank you for coming, Ramon Costa began, his voice steady. We understand you have a strong interest in Frankie de Jong. Tom Edwards nodded, flipping open a leather binder. Indeed, Frankie is a key target for us. We believe he would be a tremendous asset to our squad. We're here to discuss a potential agreement that works for both sides. Laura Green slid a detailed proposal across the table. This outlines our offer, including the transfer fee and performance-based bonuses. We've structured it to address your current financial situation while reflecting Frankie's value. Elena Morales reviewed the document carefully. It's a substantial offer, but as you know, Frankie plays a crucial role in our plans. We need to ensure that any move aligns with our long-term strategy. The conversation was meticulous and intense. Each side presented their case, with Manchester United emphasizing their vision for the future and Barcelona defending their need to keep key players for stability and growth. As the meeting progressed, it became clear that both clubs were deeply invested in the negotiations. After hours of discussion and several rounds of adjustments to the proposal, Tom Edwards leaned forward, his voice steady. We're committed to making this work. If necessary, we're prepared to revisit the terms to accommodate your needs. Ramon Costa nodded thoughtfully. We appreciate your flexibility. We'll need some time to review and discuss internally. 
Our goal is to find a resolution that benefits both clubs. As the meeting drew to a close, there was a palpable sense of anticipation. Both sides understood that the coming days would be critical in determining the outcome. Frankie de Jong's future was hanging in the balance, and the resolution of these negotiations would be eagerly awaited by fans and stakeholders across Europe. The representatives from Manchester United left Camp Nou with a mixture of hope and patience. Meanwhile, Nusir Mazraoui sends one word message as Man United transfer wait continues. Bayern Munich fullback Nusir Mazraoui is keen on a reunion with Eric Ten Hag, but Manchester United need to complete a departure first. Bayern Munich defender Nusser Mazraoui has given an insight into his pre-season preparations, as his transfer to Manchester United remains on hold. Mazraoui has emerged as a target for Eric Ten Hag this summer, after it became clear that Aaron Wan-Bissaka would not be offered a new deal at the club. The Englishman's contract expires in 2025, and the ambition at Old Trafford is to recoup some money by selling him. As such, the Reds need a right-back replacement, and Mazraoui is at the top of their list. The Moroccan came through the youth ranks at Ajax to star for Ten Hag prior to the Dutchman's switch to United in the summer of 2022. That same summer, Mazraoui decided he wanted to move on to pastures new and chose to join Bayern. However, since moving to Bavaria, the 26-year-old has grown frustrated at the lack of opportunities he has been afforded. Men's Sport understands this frustration has led to Mazraoui favoring a move to Old Trafford and United are confident they will be able to complete a deal. However, the holdup relates to the future of Juan Bissaka. They have yet to secure a transfer for the Englishman despite West Ham being strongly interested in the right back. Once Juan Bissaka is sold, United are expected to complete a deal for Mazraoui. Until this is over the line, Mazraoui remains a Bayern player and he is preparing for the start of the new season in Germany. Munich's first competitive fixture of the campaign is a week on Friday in the DFB Pokal Cup competition away at Ulm, and in preparation for that fixture, it appears the Moroccan has been training closely with Eric Die. The former Tottenham man shared a picture of himself with Mazraoui with the caption, Iceman. The right back responded on his story with the message, Icy. While not too much can be gleaned from this interaction, it at least reiterates that Mazraoui has not been frozen out of the Bayern first team in preparation for his potential exit. As Manchester United continues to wait on a potential transfer for Moroccan defender Usair Mazraoui, the player has taken to social media to share a cryptic one-word message. Soon. Mazraoui, who has been a subject of transfer speculation throughout the summer, is reportedly a key target for Manchester United as they look to strengthen their defensive options. His recent post has sparked further intrigue among fans and pundits, hinting at possible developments in the transfer saga. The 26-year-old right-back has been in strong form for both his club and national team, showcasing his defensive capabilities and attacking prowess. His performances have made him an attractive prospect for United, who are keen to bolster their squad ahead of the new season. Mazraoui's soon message could suggest that an announcement regarding his transfer could be imminent, though it leaves much to speculation. The one-word update has ignited excitement among United supporters, who are eagerly awaiting news on whether the talented defender will be joining their ranks. As the transfer window progresses, all eyes will be on any further developments involving Mazraoui and Manchester United. The anticipation continues to build as fans and media await confirmation of the player's next move. Bayern Munich fullback Nusair Mazraoui has expressed a strong desire for a reunion with Eric Ten Hag, his former manager, at Manchester United. However, before any potential transfer can be completed, Manchester United must first resolve a key issue involving a player departure. Mazraoui, who has been a standout performer for Bayern Munich, is reportedly enthusiastic about the prospect of working once again under Ten Hag, 
The pair enjoyed a successful stint together at Ajax, where Ten Hag's tactical acumen and Mazraoui's defensive solidity played a significant role in the team's achievements. Manchester United, keen to bolster their defensive options, have identified Mazraoui as a prime target. However, the club faces a logistical challenge. Before they can finalize any deal for the Moroccan international, they need to offload one or more players to balance their squad and finances. The need to make space for new arrivals is crucial in the current transfer climate. The situation adds a layer of complexity to the transfer negotiations. United's management is working diligently to address the departures and create the necessary room in the squad for Mazraoui. Until this issue is resolved, the potential move remains in limbo. Mazraoui's eagerness to join Manchester United and reunite with Ten Hag has been noted, making the transfer an enticing prospect for both player and club. Other news.